cannot wait to share this with you. This is Liam's Cookie Monster Jar. And um, it's a cookie jar for a cookie monster. But let me just, I'll tell you really quick what the project is in case this is your first time seeing what projects I'm working on right now. Um, the Family Justice Center of Stanislaus County has an art workshop for children that are abused and in challenging situations and they help them heal through art. It's um, ARK, Art Restores Kids. And it's a really great program for the children. And what they've done is they've collected the artwork from the children and they've called artists in the area that wanted to participate and donate an art piece for fundraising. And they gave us, they let us choose which art pieces we'd like to do, we'd be inspired from. And I grabbed two. I think we were only supposed to grab one, but I grabbed two. <laughs> and um, I, this is the second one. I, the first one that I shared with you is Kate's Butterfly, and I'll make another update on that. We had a little bit of a disaster on that one. But you'll see that in another video. But this one, I love. Monster and Me. This was the, actually the first one that I selected out of all of them. Uh, I love this little monster because what he said was really appropriate. I could just see who this little boy was or is. And uh, it says, he is really nice, but no one knows. And that, I'm kind of going more from the words on this than I actually am from the shape and form of this. I was inspired by it, um, more by how I envisioned this little boy. Here, let me share that with you really quick. The name of the, the project they were working on was called Monster in Me. And I just imagine a little boy that gets in trouble all the time. And he just believes. Everyone thinks he's a bad kid, but inside he really, I'm really nice. I really am. And he just doesn't know how to express himself properly to, to share that. So that's kind of the vision I got, nice on the inside. And that phrase, nice on the inside, kept coming back to me, nice on the inside which led me to a cookie jar because everyone loves to open up a cookie jar because it's nice on the inside. Yeah. So uh, I thought a cookie monster, not like your Sesame Street cookie monster. Uh, I did grab elements. My inspiration for this, I'll explain really quick. Um, what he said was more important than how this physically looked to me at first. Um, but then when I look at this, I, I grabbed elements. I realized there's a lot of little tentacles or legs, but I took them as tentacles here or just little things coming out from the monster and the little diamond eyes. And I haven't glazed the color yet. I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do for that. But I may grab some colors out of his his um, project here to, to blend it together. But I can't wait to share this with you. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's clip. I didn't share all of my the making of. I didn't show how I threw the the pot in the lid. I got to the trimming part. I just didn't have the camera on. I was still, I was really trying to focus more than I was document, if that makes sense. But uh, anyway, uh, let me just share it with you. I hope you guys enjoy, and I'll talk to you at the end about it too. I have three ideas mulling around in my head. I was thinking I could make a monster mug and making this thing just kind of like a soup bowl type thing. Or I had this idea of making the phrase nice on the inside. So I'd make the monster be either a candy a candy bowl or, or a cookie jar and then have the phrase nice on the inside. So right now I just threw the, the form. I think this is the one I want to use for the base form. But do I want to make it a mug? a cookie jar, or a candy bowl. It's not candy bowl, but it could be. You could put jelly beans in there. Anyway.
what I wanted to share was I really on the first one I made the butterfly to look like the butterfly and this one I, his project doesn't look exactly like the monster he made but I made him one and I thought this one looked a little bit more like his guy and I'll give it to him hopefully I'll Cindy if it's okay I'll go ahead and um, give this to you if you can give it to Liam because it says good boy on here because I want him to know that he is a good boy anyway hope you guys enjoyed today's clip we'll see you next time mm -hmm.